Hey Sagittarius friends, welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I hope you guys are all doing well. So this is going to be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs. March 16th to April 20th. And just as a reminder, Sag, if the reading does not resonate for you, please watch your other signs. Sagittarius. Sag, those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Instant Go. Links to everything that you guys need are right below the video in the description box. deck. Okay, four of pentacles, which is a more conservative energy. Um, I do feel like you could be trying to save more money in this deck. And you know, you do have a, you do have pentacles in this reading. So some of you definitely could be focused on your finances, definitely saving money. Your overall energy is the page of wands. You definitely could be hearing something, you know, something could be coming through. It's exciting. And I feel like those of you that have been waiting on hearing from someone or waiting for something, that absolutely could be happening for you over the next two weeks. I really love the Page of Wands in this deck. No, definitely planning on going down a journey. I see it with the Six of Wands here, but we'll get to that. Some of you are absolutely starting down an exciting new path, an exciting new venture. Also with the Page of Wands is the overall energy. You're definitely excited to start down this new path and for some of you it could be something career with the four of pentacles some of you definitely could be focused on saving even your savings account either because of this or you're focused on how much money you have because of this it might cost some money something for some of you and then you have temperance with the two of pentacles which is your card sag temperance you know i almost feel like you know honestly <laughs> temperance the two of pentacles the four of pentacles you could be moving money around playing with money you're playing with your savings savings account. Definitely with this combination. You know, and both of these cards, Temperance and the Two of Pentacles, represent balance. And so, if you're starting something new or you're hearing something about it over the next two weeks, for some of you, that could be the reason why you need to look at your finances. And for others of you, I feel like this is what is needed is balance because you could be juggling you could have a lot going on and for some of you with this page of wands it could even be you know some kind of opportunity that's coming in for you 
that's exciting and you have so much going on and you're just trying to find time for everything, everyone. You know, the page is the overall energy and you also have a couple of nights in this reading. So with all these nights, definitely messages, communication, important for a, a lot of you. For some of you, I definitely see an offer coming in. For some of you, this could even have something to do with your children or a child. Because I am seeing a lot of young men here. So definitely could be in regards to a child or children, probably a boy. Or maybe you have a couple of boys, even your grandchildren. And then here you have the King of Swords. So I'm definitely reading for some Sagittarius males. You have air in your chart. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And you also have the Knight of Swords. So some of you definitely are hearing something very suddenly. You know, fast, quick. You know, this is some fast moving energy here. But temperance is about patience. And it is your card. You're waiting on this, Sagittarius. I really feel like you're anticipating this, but very quickly, probably after you hear something concerning this Page of Wands, the Knight of Swords, you could actually, some of you are taking action. You know, this is someone that's ready to charge forward, move forward very quickly. So some of you, as soon as you hear something or even once you figure something out, you're going to move very, very quickly. And then you have the Queen of Pentacles. So if, for you Sages, if you have Virgo Taurus, you can have Virgo Taurus Capricorn in your chart. You know, this, this definitely... Could be your energy over the next two weeks. Very focused on finances, career. You also have the Six of Wands. Card of victory, success. Like, you're the star. You're on fire. Definitely some kind of success that's coming to you. If this is within your career, it could be why you have this opportunity that's coming in for you. Because you probably were recognized for something. Some of you, I definitely feel like all of your hard work and patience was just totally recognized. You also have the Knight of Cups. Emotional offer or opportunity that, you know, is emotional, but it is going to make you emotionally very happy. It, this is emotionally exciting for you, definitely. For those of you that are going to be doing something in the near future, it absolutely is going to be very exciting for you with this combination. You know, this is something that you've had to be very, very patient with, Sag. Some of you have been waiting on this with anticipation, anticipating this for a while because you do have temperance and you also have strength. You know, and this, this combination is definitely telling you to be strong, be patient. Being strong and patient, waiting, but it's like... Sag, as soon as the time comes, 
you hear something or when something is right in front of you, you're ready to move forward very, very quickly. With the King of Swords energy, the Knight of Swords, the King is someone that's very focused. You know, and the Queen of Pentacles is very grounded. And the Six of Wands is success. And you have a lot of amazing positive energy. Sure, some of you have a lot going on, family work. Some of you definitely could be juggling. Others of you, I feel like you've been patient. But I feel like over the next two weeks, you're you're hearing something very quickly, very suddenly. And it's like you're you're ready to just take action and move. You're charging forward. What's under this Four of Pentacles? The Hermit. So some of you have definitely been waiting. And those of you that have been dealing with an Earth sign. Oh, sorry. It could be a Virgo. Then you have the Nine of Pentacles. Some of you definitely are moving towards success. abundance like living 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 a comfortable life this man or woman is very secure you know she's got all that money on that beautiful tree with all these pentacles she's worked very hard or he and has a lot to show for themselves so some of you this is what you're manifesting with the Six of Wands, it definitely is what you're moving toward. It's what you're manifesting. You know, the Six of Wands really is all of your hard work being recognized. With the Nine of Pentacles, you know, it does represent status. Some of you could be definitely moving up to a much higher paying position with the company that you currently work for. It's, some of you definitely could have multiple options here. Maybe you need to look at something closely, make a decision, and then act. And I, I do feel like that's what the majority are doing. Are, you are doing. As soon as you hear something... You're just moving and taking action. Let me grab you an oracle card. Blessing on your wisdom. You know, so you have this amazing positive energy around you. You have this good fortune that's coming in. And like I mentioned, you know, maybe you are weighing your options, you, you, know, you know, multiple choices in front of you. And sometimes, honest to God, that does happen. When it rains, it pours. And some of you probably have uh, to make a choice. You have to... Pick one, take your time, and when you're ready, charge forward, which I already see you doing because you're manifesting. Great reading, Sag. If it didn't resonate, please watch your other signs. And those of you that are not subscribed to my channel, please be sure to subscribe. And I will see you guys back here soon. Take care, guys.